Welcome back to another Unturned video. Today I went solo on a populated Elver server and we're going to do a very epic Rex to Riches. If you guys enjoy Elver content and perhaps even want an Elver vanilla series, let me know by dropping a like. Let's aim for 500 likes. Subscribe if you haven't already, less than 30% of you guys watching right now are subscribed and I would really appreciate it. Also last video I announced a mythical giveaway and this is the winner. To claim your prize, please join my discord and contact me there. Today we're going to roll another one which is a Melting Aces High Calling card. To have a chance to win this giveaway make sure that you have subscribed, liked and comment something below. If you're channel member you also have a higher chance to win but before we go into the video i would like to shout out today's sponsor which is pine hosting pine hosting is the best option if you want to make your own server for you and your friends with pine hosting you can create your servers in a very short time and they have very high performance they are very easy to use locations are all around the world cheap prizes workshop installer and much more cool features if you use my code which is ldg you get 30 percent of your order the link will be in the description below and let's get straight into the video uh, and we are currently joining Elver. It has been a while since I have played Elver. There are some people on the server. Yes, sir, we are in. Yeah, there are 14 people on. It is quite early in the morning, though, so people might join later on. Right, there's a small vault system as well. That's pretty nice. All right, well, I'm gonna go straight to Junction. Yeah, I hear shots already. But the thing about Elver is that even if there are only a few people, you will find PvP every single place you go. Yeah, it seems like it's actually already been looted. Yeah, there's a zombie over there. We got ourselves a puck, military knife. Our first weapon, let's go. Alright, some pants. Alright, obviously I will want to try to build a base. Oh, there's a guy right there. Oh, he's naked. Why, hello there. Oh, stop running away from me. Oh, he's actually running away. Come back here, dude. He's dead. He obviously didn't have anything, but I'm gonna kill- Oh, I hear a car. Alright, please drop me some ammo. Oh, I hear shots. Oh, he did drop me ammo. Right, I think that gun was a sauce. Okay, there are dead zombies over here. Got ourselves a backpack. I'm gonna try to kill that sniper, dude. I don't know where he is, though. Oh, there's a naked next to me. Oh, wait, he's right behind this hill. Hopefully, he's the same dude. Oh, yeah. Alright, he's dead. I had to put a full magazine into him. Oh, yeah, he's actually stacked. Alright, grenades. Got ourselves a pog as well. It's not that much loot, but better than nothing, I will vault these items. I don't know why I vaulted the painting, but that will look pretty sick in our base. Put the grenade in our vault. It could be useful later on. Yeah, here are a lot of shots actually. Alright, salvage everything. Made ourselves a bed. The rest will go into bandages. We'll hotkey the bandage. And now I will attempt to look somewhere to build a base or something, man. I'm gonna loot hospital as well since we're here. Maybe we'll get ourselves a defibrillator battery. Because I will want to either go to the safe zone or go to the dead zone. Or both. Let's take the metal can. Yeah, I hear people shooting. They have a golden hellcat, damn. Alright, salvage those. Oh, I hear steps. Oh yeah, there's a guy coming. He's dead. Anything? Oh yeah, he has, does have some stuff. He has a magazine for me. Anything down here? Nope. Alright, let's salvage those. Alright, I think it's safe to say we should build a base. We're literally finding so many people everywhere where we go, man. Yeah, somebody looted the hospital too. Civilian night vision. Some ammo. We'll take the metal. Alright, so I found this base. There's a bunch of lockers in here. There's a bunch of lockers in here. And all I can do is a door. And I would have this, like, whole area. But it's quite small. But perhaps for now it would be enough. There's also a bunch of crates. Yeah, I'll put... I need to find somewhere where I can put the bed. Because the campfire is in the way. But perhaps... Yeah, there we go. Get ourselves the perfect pixel. I'm gonna destroy the campfire. We don't need that in here. But I still need to make myself a door. And we can make it. We just needed five metal. Good. Alright, there's some stuff actually in here as well. There's a valentine. Oh yeah, there's a lot of guns. Salvage the pitchfork. Get ourselves another door. Yeah, these crates are full of weapons, man. Yeah, just turn day. I'm gonna chop down a tree with this knife so that in the base we can build like a, a wall and a pillar. You guys will see. So that we can actually extend the base a bit. Alright, there we go. Bunch of logs. Plus, people will probably never assume that there's a person living in this base since they see a wooden door. Alright, so if I place it right over here... Yeah, I can't because of the leather. Alright, so I'm gonna have to re-salvage this and then extend it from the other side. Alright, so if we put a pillar and a wall in here, we would have all of this area. Yeah, I hear shots. Can I perhaps place it here? No, it's still blocked. I wanna go counter those PvP, man. Yeah, there's a lot of shooting going on. Right, let's put a pillar. Now, obviously, later on I will have my own base. This is just temporary. Just so that I have a place to survive. Oh, blocked by seeds. It's alright. We could forge them. Still blocked. There we go. Now, I still need to make myself another wall. Put the door there. Alright, so for a metal wall, I need 10 sheets. So, I'm gonna salvage these guns. I'm never going to use them. And there we go. We've just extended our base by a bit. Alright, so let's see if we can drop anything that we don't need. We'll put the rope in there as well. Yeah, these guns are pretty nice, man. There's fully decked out pogs, snipers. Same time, I will empty my vault. We'll put... Alright, we'll put this sight on that, and let's go try to kill some people. 
All right, so I'm currently over at the mall. From here, I'm trying to get graphics cards, new phones, all of those important items. Now, I don't know what these presents actually are. I have never ever seen them in my life. I don't know if they're a new item. Perhaps it's because it's Christmas time right now. I'm gonna put them in vault though. We'll see what they are later on. All right, come on, give me something good in here. Not a new phone, lovely. Oh, another one. Perfect. There's zombies. Hold on. All right, so those U phones will definitely go inside my my vault. We also got some tape, which is very very important. Same time, there's a mechanical area over here. We will try to get a blowtorch. If we got one, then that would be really really good because I can start making lockers. Yeah, chemicals. Come on, bro. Give me a blowtorch. Never mind. All right, so next we're gonna go to Junction. If there are people there, we will try to kill them. And hopefully they will have some high tier loot. All right, I'm back in my little small base. I hear a lot of shots going on in the background. So we will go try to see what's going on. We'll put the U-phones in there, the chemicals, the metal, the tape, ev literally everything we don't want to lose if we die. All right, so we also did pick a spot that is very, very close to the junction. So every time we hear shots, it's probably going on over there. Now, later on, I will also attempt to raid those lockers in that little base. Yeah, there's a lot of shots very, very close. Yeah, that's the Hellcat being shot as well. Oh, loot right over here. Yeah, Mosca. Alright, well, I am terrified. Yeah, there's two guys and there's, there's a third guy shooting at them. There's a naked. There's three guys. One guy dead. Alright, killed the other two. Golden Hellcat, that's mine. Okay, well, bunch of ammo. Oh, I'm going to die. Yeah. Bro, there are like five people. Oh, that's a 3-0. And another trio. Alright, well, the struggles of being a solo. No matter how many people you kill, they will always come back because of TPA. Let's pick a gun. We will return. Oh, Valentine. I love this gun. Hopefully, I will kill everyone with it. Well, that really goes well. <laughs> well, there goes our Valentine. Yeah, there's way too many people, actually. I mean, I'm still not gonna give up. I'm still gonna go back. I'm still gonna give it a try. If we fail this one, then we will not have any good guns to kill them with. Then we would only have the one Pog. And I don't want to lose every single good PvP gun. So this is going to be our final try. If we do get to kill all of them though, then that would be sick. Because we get ourselves really, really high tier loot. But if we don't, then it would be an L. There's people with Moscas, Hellcats, everything over there, man. Oh, okay. Well, there's a fully geared guy there with glowing clothes. He has no clue about me. There's more people, obviously. Let's kill this dude. Alright, we got him. Okay, yeah, he's stacked. He has candy cane weapons. I don't even know how to get those. Oh, I can't home anyway. And I can't vault. Oh, that's just where everything. Oh. Bro, how the hell did he not kill me? Let's go a bit back because I am at 15 HP and I don't have any meds. Alright, I'm just gonna run away. Let's turn our cosmetics off because they are literally glowing. I am going to vault a fully decked out pog. Yeah, I have full thick, man. Alright, that was very epic rex switches. It was from behind, but I don't know how the second guy did not kill me. But honestly, it doesn't matter because because all that matters is the loot. Right, I'm in the hospital. I'm trying to get some meds, man. Splint, lovely. Clot. Lovely. No, I don't want to die from zombies. Tape. Yeah, all the PvP is still going on back there, so I will go back to base. I will drop all of the thick clothes, and I will just go back with the pog and try to do the same thing over and over. That is how you get easy loot. Yeah, the shots aren't stopping. There's people with pay to win ranks as well. Please let me know how you get the candy cane, Mosca, and Elver. I know that currently it is Christmas time, but I really don't know how to get them. All right, I'm going to put all of the frozen cosmetics over there. Yeah, I need to make myself some more space, actually. Well, there's a guy over there. I don't know if he's actually naked. Hit him a couple of times. Yeah, I think he's naked, actually. He's dead. I'm gonna go with the Mosca. This is a very, very good gun. But if I lose it, I will be a bit upset, but uh, it's fine, honestly. Yeah, all the shooting. Oh, there's a guy there. He's dead. More shots. Another guy dead. There's a guy behind the tree. I am at 9 HP. All right, thankfully, I got a dressing with me. Oh, there's even more people up there. I see him. Oh, two guys. One guy dead. Both dead. All right, let's take loot and leave. At least back. A bunch of ammo. Oh, high cal. Fully decked out Valentine with the extended magazine. Even more high cal. There's another loot pile here. Oh, even more thick clothes. Lovely. All right, yeah, we're stacked. Let's get out of here. Bro, we're doing insane PvP right now. I don't know how I killed like a three-man team right now. All right, yeah, we are going back to base. Vault. I mean, I don't have anything to put over there. And we are back. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. Insane solo Rex riches against extremely geared people. Keep in mind, I joined the server like half an hour ago. Or even less. Oh, there's a lot of people. There's people in melee and there's uh, some people right there. Oh, yeah, he's standing up. All right, killed one. Headshot him. Oh, he's dead. And I'm dead. Let's punch this man to death. Easy. Alright, I'm gonna try to get another gun and we'll go back. I lost the candy cane, Moscow, man. It feels bad. Alright, so I looted farm. Got myself some items. We got ourselves a sentry engine as well. We're gonna put that in vault. Same time, I also did get myself a pog. And I had an extended magazine in my vault, so we put that bad boy in it. 
This whole time the shooting hasn't even stopped, man. Also, there's like a six-man team on the server, which I think are always here. They're always at junction. Yeah, here the dead zone under me. There's a dead body here. Oh, blowtorch. I was going straight in my vault. I heard people reload. Oh, dead body right there. There's a sniper behind the ghost thing. There's a guy by that tree. Yeah, everyone's with Moskos and all of that. I'm gonna try to kill the guy by the tree. I'm gonna focus on him first. Seems like the rest of the people are PvPing between each other. And I think this guy back here is alone. So he's an easy target. Yes, sir. He's dead. Let's hide in the loot. I'm homing. At the same time, let's pick up all of the loot. We got ourselves a pendiculator. Some thick clothes. Alright, not too bad. And our storage is already full. Lovely. I need to make even more. It's kind of incredible I'm getting dead zone items and I haven't even gone to the dead zone. Oh, someone is shooting a rebel. Uh, I definitely want that. Yeah, that guy is in his six-man team. Alright, he's probably camping somewhere with a sniper, man. Yeah, someone's shooting a shotgun as well. Oh, I see him glowing. There's two people under me. One of them's a naked. Alright, he's dead. Yeah, nothing too good, actually. Oh, damn, there's a lot of cloth in here. I'll take the metal, though. Yeah, some cans as well. I hear steps. Oh. Yeah, he's dead. Magazine for me, thank you. Bunch of more loot over here. Gyroscope. Oh, I'm getting shot at. I'm gonna die. Oh no, he's there. Yeah, thankfully he doesn't really have that much good aim. Alright, so I had to make splints. Kinda used all the metal that I had. We'll put the gyro in vault. Oh, this man just died right next to me. He's gonna try to go around me, 100%. But I'm gonna go up the tower. If I survive? Yes, sir. Right, let's equip our splints. He's just gonna be camping up there. I'm getting shot at by somebody else. Bro, there's two guys looking at me right now. Headshot. Alright, honestly, I don't think I'm gonna survive this. Alright, we're up. Alright, well, they are far from each other, so perhaps if I try to kill one, the, top, the dude at the top. Headshot. Headshot. Yeah, there's somebody under me right now. Bro, there's like three people, I think, that are trying to rush me. There's a guy literally right under me. Oh, it's the DJ Helm, dude. He's coming over and over. I don't even have that much ammo, man. We got ourselves a full magazine. Dude, I'm gonna jump down. I don't even care. This dude dead. Bro, he's so weak. I body shot him and headshot him twice. I'm gonna, I'm gonna rush. Bro, where did he go? Oh. How the hell did he go over there? <laughs> Alright, well, I'm dead. Yeah, this guy's in a three-man team, obviously. That's fine, I only lost a pog. And we did get ourselves a gyroscope. So a gyroscope is used for components, by the way, if you didn't know, but we still need a defibrillator battery in order to do that. But that is quite easy to get, because we are right next to the hospital and they spawn at the hospital. So at a point, I will just be looting hospital just for defibrillator batteries. Oh, there's people over there. Oh, they're killing each other. Oh, rebel guy up there as well. Bro, there's so many people, man. I'm gonna try to focus on the rebel guy, obviously. If we get the rebel, then that would be a huge W. Oh yeah, he TP'd his buddy in. There's some loot down there. I think it's that's a gyro. Okay, well, there are four people over there. Oh, he's dead. So they're the dead. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the six-man team. Alright, watch this. I'm gonna pick up everything. Easy loot. There's a Mosca. Alright, let's go. What did we get? Yeah, we got a Mosca. Some thick clothes. I hit him once. Yeah, there's too many people. I shot another dude. I'm gonna home. I'm gonna get out of here, man. What can I vault? Yeah, we're back. All right, let's go. And we also did get ourselves a defibrillator battery, which I did put in vault, as you guys may see. We did just get ourselves two Moscas, one of them candy cane. We got ourselves uh, two bogs, a tusk, night vision. So, hey, that's pretty good. All right, so I'm gonna loot over here. Oh, well, there's people in a vehicle. Yeah, my guy's just chilling there. Oh, he's dead. Anything good, my guy? Uh, wait, there's another dude. Hi. Alright, this dude had ammo, clothes, night vision. Alright, at the same time, I'm getting all of the key cards so that we can access the dead zone. Because I'm gonna do a dead zone run really quickly. I'm not actually not gonna get all of them. I can't be bothered. I'm gonna get the important ones. Especially the blue one, because from there, we get ourselves the rebel. And perhaps even heat waves do spawn there. So if we get a heat wave, then that would be really, really good. And we get ourselves a blowtorch too. Absolutely beautiful. I made myself a couple of lockers. Finally. Now PvP did also start to escalate down a bit, so now we can actually start doing some progress when it comes to the map. We also did get ourselves mesh from this run, so we can maybe do ourselves a filter, but we need uh, components, which I already have just crafted one. So filter is ready, now we need rubber. Now in rubber, I did get myself quite a ton already. Alright, and we got ourselves the gas mask, ladies and gentlemen. So with one gas mask, we're going to go do a dead zone run. I am going to do it as fast as possible. I am going to hope that we get ourselves a rebel for sure. 
and perhaps even a heat wave or gunpowder and then from there we can attempt to perhaps start doing base raids for now i'm not really worried about base raids first of all i actually didn't find any unrated bases yet but doing a dead zone run is something that i have to do so that i actually feel a bit accomplished from this rex riches since most of the items i actually got them from pvp there's a dude over there annihilated yeah he doesn't have anything good i'll take some ammo all right and here we go now we did enter from the construction site now i didn't bring actually night vision with me but it's fine i would do it anyway all right so i actually forgot which key cards i got i think i did get the red key card now later on i would actually do another dead zone run with all of the key cards now i actually don't think i did get the red key card yeah we didn't it's okay what matters is the blue key card more than anything to be completely honest yes yeah, sir blow there's absolutely nothing in here all right a valentine yeah a tusk and a shotgun we don't need those all right let's get the rebel and the mosca there's a fully decked out pog but we're not gonna take wait heat wave lovely there we go pendicule laser all right that's honestly all i wanted we'll drop the cans for now all right this dead zone run is secure all right, so there's still another whole area with blue where there's uh yeah components like that metal can gyroscope beautiful another gyro u phone yeah we can do another components military radio cans i mean i will take the cans i should have another room unlocked though pretty sure i unlocked purple yeah there's people shooting rebels right above me yeah i don't think I, yeah i didn't have that one either it's for purple we should have it yes sir oh detonator beautiful there's a can over there we don't need that right now headlamp you know i will wear it just so that it looks a bit better oh, drill beautiful bro i'm getting everything i need from this run yes sir and gunpowder absolutely amazing tape and yeah, there should be a components room in here as well yes sir military radio you phone can circuit board amazing gyroscope you phone bro this has to be one of the best dead zone runs i've done in just two rooms yourselves heat wave detonator rebel and gunpowder and the drill which we didn't have any of those before bro he hit me dodged dead all right let's go oh mesh beautiful that's home ourselves four tusks from that bro wait what what did you just say i don't see him oh, he got a graphics card though that's a, that's actually really good all right let's go back to base i gotta have to walk it because i homed and i moved so we would have needed to wait a minute all right so i'm currently building a little base i'm gonna move away from junction 67 i think get all of the items with me that are important the rest are still there i will just go get them later on but yeah we're gonna build it next to the gas station somewhere a bit peaceful because last time the pvp literally didn't stop all right so base one by one is done nothing really that special for now but at least it's actually mine and i wouldn't have to worry about the real owner coming on and savaging my base bro die there we go uh tusk and elise back salvage salvage actually perfect i needed to make a bed an airdrop is also landing right over here hopefully it's full of mesh probably not but even if we just get one mesh then that would be really really good never mind a uh, bunch of guns a bunch of ammo some attachments yeah airdrops ever aren't really that good unless you get mesh in my opinion i made myself a couple more lockers we need to upgrade base it's already uh getting a bit cramped up there's a guy right here is he going for the airdrop my guy bro he's dead he actually wanted to go for the airdrop i guess uh it's already been looted and he's dead yeah task tape i think this is the same guy that i just killed like five minutes ago as well all right so i'm also going to mine as much metal as possible so that we can start making ourselves a metal base get ourselves some tape metal scrap we're gonna get ourselves quite a ton from this area actually i made myself quite a ton of more lockers when we still have a lot of metal left so all the remaining metal i will make it into making the base bigger i don't even have space to put these lockers man because the radios are kind of in the way all right so it's time for the second dead zone run i did get all of the key cards now so we're gonna do a full dead zone run i got myself an extra filter by the way looks like we have a filter and uh 30 so hey that's pretty good uh, i'm currently homing i'm full of loot got myself some really really good items such as two heat waves even though we just need the ammo from it we get ourselves a bunch of components steel wheelie hellcat a missile fishing rod mk2 a bunch of components pretty sure i got two rebels as well so i'm really happy with this run i also made myself some of the big boy lockers with the circuit boards all right we got ourselves the scripture and here we go now i did bring some of these presents with me i don't know what they even are all right let's go
Well, alright everybody, that's going to be it for this video. I really, really hope that you guys did enjoy. If you guys want more Elver content, perhaps a series as I said in the beginning, let me know in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye!